Hello and welcome to another Steam Deck gameplay video. Got something super exciting right here, Doom Eternal. The reason I'm excited is because the settings that you can play this bad boy at. So if I go over to the uh, settings and go to video, it is on native resolution and everything is maxed out. Literally, if I go down, everything is on ultra nightmare right there. Everything is maxed out, which is fantastic. We've got depth of field and we've got depth of field anti-aliasing as well. I'm going to go into horde mode just so we can get loads of enemies coming at me. And, you know, you can see it for yourself. Let's go, yes. Okay, so, low spoiler, at maxing everything out as is, you will get frame drops, but you can achieve close to 60. But there's a little, I wouldn't call it a hack, but a little sort of tweak that we can do that we can basically get almost the same visual fidelity, have it maxed out, and get, you know, a solid 60 frames a second. But first of all, I'm just going to show you the gameplay for a couple of minutes of it like this, and then I'll show you the little tweak that we can do to get a solid 60. I'll put the volume up as well so you can hear it. So, so far we're getting 60. It will start dropping down once enemies start to appear, which they will soon. Let it begin! As you see, we're, overall we are getting good frames. Um, we do get the occasional drop here and there. This is insane to have Doom Eternal that is came out not long ago. And uh, how many did come out? I think two years ago now. But to have it maxed out, it's insane. Obviously, we have a lower resolution due to you know the Steam Deck and a smaller screen size, but it's insane. Terribly here. Honestly, you could literally play it like this and you'll still get great experience. The, for the most part, it's solid. Uh, and, and like, you got some drop there to like what 54 I saw. So, again, still minor stuff. I mean, you could cap it if you wanted to, but there's a better way of doing it, which I'll show you momentarily. So obviously we saw a lot of frame drop there down to the 40s. So what we want to do, there's a little feature in a lot of modern games and Doom Internal has this feature, and it's dynamic resolution. So if we go to video, go towards the bottom, and go to resolution scaling mode, select that, go to dynamic, and with dynamic we can target the frame rate. So we're gonna, or we could target a higher frame rate 
we really wanted to, but we're not going to. We're just going to go and target 60. Uh, oh, it's done 66. So uh, I can make it go up if I want it. But I'm, I'm just going to target 60. That's all we need. And, and what this does is it will lower the resolution and try and get close to as 60 as possible. And it stays a solid at 60. And what we can do as an extra thing, if we press the Steam menu button here, the three dots one, go to the performance tab and and I will do use per game profile just so it's you know specific for this one scroll down go to the scanning filter put FSR on so with FSR on when it does lower you know the resolution down in certain moments even without it it looks great you can hardly notice it especially when you're in action but with this it'll sharpen it a bit more so it's you can hardly tell if at all so now i mean it's already feeling smoother So I'm see with everything going, with all these, I mean, all these explosions, I mean, yeah, you got the odd dip here and there, but like, it's a lot more stable. This is insane. Is that one ready as well? Here we go. Solid it is. It's much better than even console screen than the graphics that we're getting. Just on another level.
because as you can see doom eternal running fantastically on the steam deck you can max it out all you got to do i mean even without it it runs very well but with you know if you enable resolution scaling mode which is dynamic resolution and enable fsr you can hardly tell us it if at all and it is fantastic this machine is a beast i mean there's been there's been a few games that i played on steam deck and that have made me go like this is a beast i mean, I mean there's been actually quite a few but this is probably the, the the most recent one i was like definitely need to create a video for this one so that's it max it out enjoy doom eternal on the steam deck check out the ancient gods part one and two as well expansions available for doom eternal they were great as well so yeah fantastic runs even better than doom 2016 that's just a testament to the id development team so yeah obviously great job from them thank you very much for watching let me know what the steam deck video you would like to see just let me know in the comments if you like the video give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button in the description there will be a steam compatibility list that i'm compiling and this game will be on there along with many other games i've tested so you can see the recommended settings and if we can hit 30 or 60 frames that's it thanks for watching see you soon bye bye